The changes at the helm of the Kenya Airports Authority come barely a week after a fire gutted a huge part of the international arrivals and departure launches at the Jomo Kenyatta International Airport. The board says it has followed the due process and sent Stephen Geshoki on terminal leave and is set to advertise the vacant position over the next few weeks. He is proceeding on leave and therefore he has not been uh, removed from office for any particular reason. Gishuki assumed the position of MD at KAA in April 2010, after the then Transport Minister Amos Kimunya sanctioned his appointment. His tenure has however been riddled with controversy. The board had last year sent Gishuki on leave after he was accused of engaging in corrupt dealings in awarding tenders for expansion at the airport, a move that was later reversed by the industrial court. The row at KAA has also been evident during the recent demolition of duty-free shops associated with businessman Kamlesh Patni after the expiry of a lease agreement between the controversial businessman and the authority. The exit of Geshuki was apparently looming after differences emerged between the then permanent secretary Karanja Kibicho and the board, with Dr. Kibicho rejecting a request to renew his term while the board voted to retain him. Consequently, Lucy Mbogwa, who is the general manager for marketing, will assume the position of managing director, albeit in an acting capacity. Denis Otieno, Citizen Business.